We're up and at them this morning. It's officially Take Your Kid to Work Day. They're coming down. Hey, you coming? Yeah. Right on. Not being sat at home all day. So we're gonna get some work done. Yeah. I'm gonna use some timber cutting tools. Yeah. You gonna chop your fingers off? No. Oh, correct answers. Right, let's go. Come on, boy. So it looks like someone's just dumped a bike. They have, haven't they? Almost someone's just dumped a bike there. Almost perfectly good condition in the chains are and there's no seat. Tires are pumped up. It's got a small sprocket on the front. Oh well. It looks like it's been put here to go in the bin. Well we'll have it. Right, we've arrived at the workshop and I think today's job is clear all of the workbench off that you're sat on. Hello boy, we bought the dog too. But, we brought the dog too. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna clear all this workbench off. What I want to do is mount the table saw in here. There's no point me plumbing up all of this dust extraction system if I'm not happy with where the table saw is gonna go. So I'm gonna take it off of its little stand that it's got. I'm gonna build a separate stand under here and we'll have it sat here and then we can use all this bench as part of the outfeed table and maybe I'll maybe I'll just pop it here actually and we'll use this as the outfeed and I want to change the tabletop to half inch ply at uh, three quarter inch ply because this has just got half inch on at the minute and I don't think it's suitable it's not strong enough so that's today's task and Dom stood there like an yeah. extra just watching. But you're going to help, right? Yeah, I'll help. Right on. Let's I don't get... want to be sat at home. making this workbench and I've not really used it that long, maybe two months but it flexes on the end because it's only half inch ply and I only had half inch ply at the time but now I've got some three quarter inch hardwood ply and it is way better than this stuff so I'm going to zip this off we're going to cut a new piece of timber and then we're going to, while we've got the carcass in there before we put the new top on we're going to take the table saw and we're going to insert it into the bench itself so it's got a proper big outfeed table and it all looks like one big one big solid rock solid unit so that's the tabletop off the worktop off. A few people wanted to see the construction of this in the comments so this gives you an excellent opportunity to see how I've braced at the back to prevent any sideways motion. We braced there as well to hold it uh, and prevent any forward motion on the table with these braces and then we've got cross beam supports with uh, three by ones every sort of 18 inches. We'll extend this so it's a little bit larger and we'll incorporate the table saw into this part here. Well we really do take two steps back to take one step forward so we've taken off the really crappy folded sheet metal table extensions for the Titan bench saw, table saw and also unbolted it from the base so we just need to now make an insert above Chancellor's head on this uh, carcass in and we'll see if we can get it sat on there flush with the top of the top of the plywood that we're going to install 
first we need to make some supports to hold the bench. Just put juice box juice box on by four pure, so I'm having a cheeky one. Yeah. So this section is where the table saw is going to sit now, and I think this is a lot bigger than it was. It looks pretty good, pretty good to me. What do you think, folks? I'm really quite impressed with this. So it's solid as a rock, table saw in the center. I'm hoping actually to maybe come in this section here and put the router. We shall see. But I do want to put on a coat of varnish, but Dominic is absolutely fed up now, so we have to go and cheer him up. Put on the varnish if you want. No, it's okay mate, because I'll have to take the central section out. I suppose I could... Oh, I had a chip out though here. I had a chip out there, so I want to put some wood filler in that before we fill it. Uh, yeah, and then varnish the whole thing. You can see how square and level it all is. It's a lot better than the previous table. I'm over the moon with it. I'm really, really pleased. You can reach all the controls on the table saw. We're going to make some real good tackle with this, buddy. Yeah. Very pleased. Oh, would you look at her now? Varnished and shiny. She's an absolute beaut. I'm so proud of this table, man. I don't want to do any work on it in case I scratch it. She's beautiful. Just leave that as a decoration in your workshop. Yeah. The blowers are on, windows a little bit steamed up, and it's half past four. I think we're gonna go to Ronald McDonald's, Dominic, aren't we? Yeah. Because you've been good all day today, and doubt your mum's hair. Right, I've arrived home, the kids are in there watching Ratatouille and I want to spend some time with them this evening so I'm just going to open this package that's been here waiting for me and then I'm going to end the vlog and have a night off thank you very much folks so I think this is the uh, the air filter material for the shop yes yeah, so that's the stuff so loosely woven material, I think that's going to work a treat. So that might be a project that we get started, that we get started maybe Monday or Tuesday, depending on whether I go to work tomorrow, which is Sunday, or spend some time on the merch, which I think I should do really. Anyway, folks, just a short one today. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you tomorrow.